One of the coolest features for Crazy Talk 6 is the fact that we have multiple characters within one project. For example, we have two puppies. We can animate them together. So without further delay, let's dive in. After we load an image, we automatically get one face and one bounding box that represents the body. See the tutorial timeline editor to learn more about body and transform. After we place the facial points from one character, we can now add in another character by pressing the add button located on the top left of this panel. Then we can pull a rectangle around our character. But not all characters are rectangle in shape. That's why we can grab any of the four points and drag them to encompass more of the body shape. Then, just like with other characters, we can drag the four facial feature points to the corners of the eyes and mouth. If for any reason we wish to delete a character, we can select the character we wish to delete, then press the delete on our keyboard or press the delete button located next to the add character button on the top left bar of this panel. Also, if you wish to have your characters move around the scene, like in the family project, let me show you an easy way to keep the characters separated. Here we are in Adobe Photoshop. Loaded is the image I have for the family. Since the image is a Taga, the background is transparent. We can also use a PNG and have the alpha channel automatically remove the background for our characters. See the tutorial separating characters from backgrounds to learn more. And that is how we can load in multiple characters in our project.